The HP 15C Limited Edition, LE, was a 2011 re-release of the original HP 15C scientific calculator. However, it was using an ARM processor running a NUT emulator. This made the 15C LE much faster than the original 15C, which was released in 1982. The 15C LE release software version included a significant bug. Pause did not work more than once in a program and instead blanked the display. The program continued to run, but no output was displayed until the program was stopped. Although the 15C LE is flashable and can be upgraded, no upgrade was ever released to fix this or other bugs. A prototype of the 15C LE, labelled the 15C Plus, was initially made available to some users for beta testing, and there were also multiple software versions made available during this beta trial. The 15C LE released software is dated 041511. There are also at least two beta software releases which are dated 041111 and 080309. These beta software releases were loaded into a 15C LE and tested for the pause bug, and the earliest version is the only one that does not include it. There may be other bugs in earlier versions, for example, the overflow bug shown. Here is the 15C LE release software version and checksum as shown by the self-test option too. You can see the software checksum, the date of the software, and the copyright message. A simple program will now be shown to demonstrate the pause bug. Label A, two times, pause, go to A, done. Run the program. So we can see the first pause is executed successfully and the results displayed, then the screen goes blank. If we stop the program, we can see that it's continued to run and we can see the result. Uh, another thing to note is the overflow feature, which operates correctly with this version of software. The 15C LE can be flashed with different software using the original HP serial cable, which is shown here. These cables are hard to find these days, or you can make your own. The original cable is used here on Windows 10 with a USB to serial adapter to downgrade the 15C LE to the software dated 080309. Behind the battery, door is a interface that can be used for updating the software on the calculator which will be used now Once the cable is connected, there are specific key sequences on the calculator and the cable to begin the programming. First we press the hold the erase button and press the reset button to turn the calculator off. We turn the calculator back on again, receive an error. Now we can release the erase button, press the reset button, which turns the calculator off again, then turn the calculator back on again. Now we use the MySamba program to select the software version we want to download. and 
click download to send to the calculator. It takes about 20 seconds to download the 128K software update. The calculator looks dead during this download. Once the download is completed, press the reset button. And we can disconnect the cable. Calculator's been reset. Now we can verify that it's running a different version of software by going into the self-test and selecting option two. We can see a different checksum, a different date of the software. Now we can run the same test as before. exactly the same program, label A, two times, pause, go to A, exit program mode, and run the program. We can see the pause is functioning correctly and stopping at each result and then looping and continuing. One thing to note with this older version of software though, is that the overflow does not flash the screen, but goes blank. As can be seen, you hit clear, you get back to the overflow result. The software downgrade makes the 15C LE more usable for programming by fixing the pause bug. The release version of software can also be reloaded if other bugs in the older software impact your usage.